If you want to learn how to make a horizontal video to a vertical video on CapCut just like this, plus if you want to learn how to move the camera so you can track and follow any moving subject in your vertical videos, then keep watching because this video will show you how step by step. All right, let's use this video as an example. So we have a horizontal video. First, you need to change the aspect ratio. So just click on ratio and then you want to change it to 9 by 16. So if I click on 9 by 16, you can see that now it's in the shape of a vertical video. Next, if you click on the video, you can click and hold any of the corners. Then you just pull it and make the video bigger just like this. And you can adjust the video, you can move it to the left like this, or you can move it to the right. Or you can just keep it in the middle like this. So this is how you convert a horizontal video into a vertical video. Now for some videos, we have to move the camera. So let me show you an example. So first let's put her in the middle. And if I play the video, you can see that she is actually moving out of the frame like this. And then at this point, you can see she's actually moving out of the video. So we need to move the camera so that we can track and follow the subject, right? So to do it, just go to the start of the video and then click on the video. And if you look on the right side at position and size, you can click on this diamond, which says add keyframe. So click on it. Now, after you add your keyframe, just play the video first. And anytime you need to move the camera, you pause the video. So let me show you. So first I will play the video. And as you can see at this point, she's kind of out of frame. I want to adjust and move the camera so that she's in the middle. That's why I paused the video. And then I'm going to move her to be in the middle. And you're going to notice that a keyframe will be automatically added at this point. So I'm going to move her to be in the middle. Now I let go of my mouse and you're going to see that a keyframe will appear just like this. Now we just repeat what we did. I'm going to play the video and anytime we need to move the camera, I will pause the video. So I'm going to play it. So now I pause it because she's at the side. So I pause the video then I adjust her to be in the middle like this. I let go. You can see we have another keyframe. Then we just continue. We play and we pause, move her to be in the middle like this. Then I play and I pause, then I adjust like this. Then I play and I pause and I move the camera like this. Then I play and I pause Then I just move her again to the middle. Play, pause, then I play, pause, move her to the middle, play. And the last frame, we can just move her to the middle like this. All right, let me play the video and show you what it looks like. So as you can see, the camera is now tracking her and following her. And throughout the video, she's in the middle at all times. So as you saw for yourself, it's very easy. Just add one keyframe and then go to the start of the video. And then you play the video. And anytime you need to adjust and move the camera, just pause the video, adjust it. And then you do it over and over again. Play, pause, adjust, play, pause, adjust until you finish the entire video.